G'day viewers, this is Troy from the Troy's Visual Arts channel. Just a little bit more progress of my Iconoscope camera project. I've now um, found a suitable way to fasten the Iconoscope tube to the mounting to sit inside the enclosure. Uh, what I've done was um, I've, I've cut up a piece of um, bicycle tube um, as a rubber strap to wrap around the tube so it'll, it can be fastened to the mount and yeah with what I had I just decided to use a, um, a washer and a screw with a, yeah, with a bit of um, edge to it and yeah I just used a bit of um, wire to tie the strap together at that point anyway um, yeah so this tube can now be seated in the enclosure of course I need a support for the neck of the tube and the um, deflection yoke that's going to be positioned about there roughly so that's the next um, step to fully fasten this tube anyway um, just give me a moment I'm gonna um, stick this mount this on the enclosure inside the enclosure and show you it's sitting inside so I'll be a so give me about a minute okay now the tube is now fastened to the to the base inside the enclosure yep i've got um it's held in by screws and of course i've uh, got some wing nuts to stick on the other end and so here you have it the tube's now fastened to the mount and sitting inside the enclosure of course i uh, yeah now i've got to um make a support down there to to support the yoke that's going to fit around that section of the tube which is the next thing to do as previously mentioned anyway I'm pretty well part way there and it's turned out quite good this uh, rubber this uh, rubber tie tube seems to do the trick in in uh, firmly holding the tube in place of course I can't let go of the tube at the moment otherwise it'll it'll sort of sag down and and the neck will hit the metal base which will possibly damage it that I don't want <laughs> god forbid anyhow that's my update for my iconoscope camera project this is Troy from Troy's Visual Arts channel signing out